how do you think it ends between Kraft and Belichick? So I think there has to be a push to come to shove conversation about changes uh, and whether or not Bill Belichick will be amenable to those. Uh, now, some of this could also be what's where are they drafting? Like I was thinking about that. Do they have a quarterback solution? Uh, but I kind of feel like it, it feels to me like it's nearing the end. Uh, that there have to be difficult conversations after the season that maybe wouldn't sit well with everybody. So I think it's a big challenge. Do you think there's a scenario in which he stays, but Kraft tells him, I'm taking away your GM power? Do you think he would ever agree to that? Well, no, I think it's totally impractical because who could be brought in that would actually be the real GM if Bill's there, right? You, you're not going to bring in someone over him or uh, uh, even anyone's going to be subordinate to him and his personality and his strength in the building, right? I think that's impractical. All right. And then, and I'm with you on that one as well. I, I think if, if he says, if Kraft says, I don't want you picking the gro buying the groceries anymore, I just want you cooking the meal, then – you know, he's out of there, and then it turns to, do you think he goes somewhere else to coach? Is yeah. there another owner who would be willing yeah. to give a guy in his 70s a clean slate hey, and say, go I got do a question it. for you. Yeah, where did Vince Lombardi finish his career? With the Washington football team. They were not called the commanders then. Are, are, are you so, saying you, you're smelling the same smoke? Well, I'm just saying, if you're if we're playing this game, Where's a place that you think is likely to change no matter what happens the rest of the season, right? And then who's a new owner that could really use some juice and credibility in the league and some guidance of how to do this stuff, right? It would probably be Washington. They could use uh, something like that. So I think there's some logic to that if we're just spitballing. And, and look, a lot of things would have to happen. He'd have to leave New England and want to coach and all of that. But I, that's kind of crossed my mind as something that could – makes sense uh, for everybody a uh, historic franchise uh, looking for a fresh start with new owner who's looking for some credibility it would certainly get a lot of people excited uh there and uh might make sense you know there are a lot of people that that are convinced todd bowles is out there's a long season ahead of him i mean anybody could win the nfc south at this point but if that were the case how about build a tampa following tom no i'm kidding that would that would never happen. And bring back Tom, you know. Right, and bring back Tom to season. Tampa then for Bill. Brockman, you cool with that one? <laughs> no. Catch the Rich Eisen Show every single day on the Roku channel, 12 to 3 Eastern for free.